Yo, yeah, right, guys, it's Matt here from Matt Strats. If you're watching this on Who's Cold Blood now, which is a very big possibility, as I am lending my videos, or some of them, some of my Skyrim videos, uh, to them to help them grow in popularity, but also help me grow in popularity and get my name out there. So if you are watching on that channel, make sure you come across to my Matt Strats and check me out. Um, all my videos will be on there. I don't just do Skyrim, I do loads of other stuff. So make sure you hit the subscribe button on my channel and boost me up. I'm at like 49 subscribers now. I'm so close to 50 and I want to get 100 as soon as possible. So help me out guys and you'll be seeing a lot more of me, well, hearing a lot more of me <laughs> around YouTube, fingers crossed. Finger crossed. Um, <laughs> anyway, so yeah, the annotations will be in the bottom, I'm hoping, and hopefully they will put a little clicky annotation on the Matt Strats thing in the top right corner, as I've left that in as it's a video that's on their channel. Anyway, today's video is basically on about the Daedric Forge, which is hidden within Winterhold. If you've not seen it yet, this is why you want to watch my videos, because this was awesome. I stumbled across it and I didn't know what it was for. Basically, you bring some ingredients together, you put them into this special offering box, and it gives you a Daedric thing. You either get weapons, armor, depending on what you ask for. Some of the more complex things, like the Daedric Armor, you'll need a Sergil Stone, but that is through a quest, and I'll talk to you about that later on. First of all, the ingredients that you will need if you want to make some stuff, like you can make frost salts, void salts, and uh, fire salts pretty quickly, and really you don't need the surgical stone to make those. So if you are going to make those, what you're going to need is, you're going to need salt, you're going to need a gem, whether you want to make void salts, it's going to be amethyst, if you want to make a frost salts, it's going to need a bit, going to, eh, you're going to need a sapphire, and if you want to make fire salts, you're going to need a ruby. So you're going to need those. The the salts on just normal salt, and you're gonna need a soul gem. I'm not entirely sure if you need it filled. I don't think you do need. Yeah, you don't think you do need it filled. I think you can have an empty one. So make sure you bring those things across. Bring a few of them. You'll. I make a boo boo later on because I make something else and I accidentally <laughs> digest the salts. I'll show you. It's ridiculous. I pressed the wrong button. But um, anyway. That's, I make salts later on. I wasn't intending to make salt straight away. As you can see, the ingredients that I've took out. Um, I actually just took out frost salts and fire salts. The, I'm going to make an astronaut, astronaut, astronaut. You know, the big frost things, or the big like frost giants, or the fiery uh, women. Those. I was going to make one of those. Um, but yeah, that's what I make first. If you do make those, they are hostile, so be warned. Because I didn't expect it to attack me, and it really does attack me. You'll see later on. It attacks me in the face. Um, so yeah, the Midden, if you've not been before, if you're fairly new to the game and you've not actually done the Winterhold quest, um, you actually have to go to the college and instead of going through any of the doors, it's around the outside, as you'll have seen, and it's just a little trap door, and you go into there. But the rest of it is basically trial and error, trying to find it downstairs, downstairs, down in the dungeons. It's not a big... Uh, area to explore it's fairly simple so if you do just keep mushing around for a little bit you will find the uh, the forge because I think I find it fairly fast there's other things you can make you can make weapons that will conjure astronauts which I don't show you how to make but um, there is a website that will tell you how to do that if you need to or you can comment me and I will tell you anyway um, but basically you need a broom and you need something else it's really stupid things that you need to convert into them um, that's the salt if you need some salt take the salt off the, off the sides because that's where you'll need it obviously um, and like I say it's a really good place to make frost salts fire salts and void salts now I've found void salts really tricky to find and they are really difficult um, but if you do make them in this place it saves all that time really so definitely come down here the, uh, what you have to do is to make the stuff you've got to offer the stuff into the box and then you pull a lever I'll show you it'll go through what uh, it'll go through it on the walkthrough in a second so you'll see everything you'll not it's not like I'm going to do things behind your back and you're not see them you see everything that's happening you put the stuff in there this is where I do, I do the wrong thing and I press X instead of offering it with square put it in the box I press X and eat it like a spaz so don't eat it <laughs> don't eat the frost you're watch, watching fire salts digest oh there you go digested right there top left of the corner gutted so I was intending to show you twice I can only show you once on the frost salts uh, to make the astronaut that's why I decide to make some frost salts myself basically just to show you how to do that as well while this is going through this bit because this is fairly simple um, putting stuff in you cannot make the Daedric weapons and the Daedric armour without the Sergil Stone and I said I'd talk about it so I'm going to talk about it now the Sergil Stone is a quest that you will get given it's a quest item that you'll get given when you get to level 90 or plus conjuring um, on your skill points 
basically, when you go to this guy in the in the college and he'll set you on this quest line to become a master conjurer, and he'll give you the Sergil Stone. Now, what you should do is you should get the Sergil Stone and instead of just doing the quest straight away because you hand it in and you conjure this thing, this Dremelord. Instead of doing that, you come down here and you you use it, I think? There is a glitch for it and you can duplicate it and you can have two, but I don't think the Surgeon Stone gets eaten up once you use it. I think it's just like a conduit sort of thing, uh, like a catalyst. So, put it you put it on and make the armor then. I'm not 100% sure though, so make sure you save before you use the Surgeon Stone because if it does get used up, you're not going to be able to get another one. So, there's your board of warning if you do want to make Daedric armor and you haven't got the 100 blacksmithing. This is a good way to do it. Um, and it'll also random enchant it. It'll be a random enchant on your armor. Not entirely, not entirely sure what enchant it will be given, but it will be on there. So you will have it enchanted as well. Right, guys, this last section uh, is basically just showing you how to get to get the the frost salts or the void salts, whatever it is I make. So it's not exactly that difficult, you just watch the tutorial and you'll see. So I'm going to take this opportunity to thank everybody that's been subscribing to me so far. I really appreciate it. I'm so close to 100, so like I said, I I'm, I'm really do thank you so much because I couldn't have done it without you, so I'm getting well enough, guys. This is for you. Um, anybody that's watching this on the channel is like, oh my god, he's so sentimental. That's me. Um, yeah, so like I said, thanks very much. If you are watching over there and you do like my stuff, come across, you're welcome. We'll have a party. Um, I've got another Modern Warfare video coming out on the Monday, so keep, in, keep watching out for that. It's an awesome gameplay. Uh, it's 44 for 0. It's a flawless mob, so make sure you watch that. Um, a little, another little thing about the, the video. If any of you are having trouble getting Daedric Hearts, which I know it is tricky sometimes, and there's not a lot of drop rate on them, you can make them with the Surgical Stone. If you get a, the, a normal heart and some other ingredients, you can make them in this thing. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. I hope it's been a success for the, for the other channel as well. Uh, and if you're up for dual comms and things like that, I'm, I'm up for that. I'm always available, so send me a comment. I am approachable. I'm not shove you away. So, thanks very much for watching guys. I will see you all very soon. Take it easy. Bye.